everyone, and welcome back to another episode of the Randomizers Podcast. I'm DJ, and of course, I'm back with my co- one of my co-hosts, John, aka Mr. Cake Dragon Man. And today we have another special guest. Today, Jim Nobody. Say hello, Jim. Hello, Jim. Uh, you don't have to call me special. <laughs> I fucking hate you, Jim. <laughs> yeah, fucking start with a dad joke. Here we go. Hate you. Uh, were we on the rails? Because it just got derailed. Oh. It's <laughs> like so God. I'm I so. Regret- so God, I'm so Everything hungry. I've done for you, I regret doing. <laughs> like, God, uh, <laughs> that one joke ended it. That's like, fucking <laughs> everything. Friendship is over. Because that one fucking joke, Timothy, just, nobody. It's, you just, you just, it's, 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 fuck it. <laughs> just walk out. It, it's, <laughs> it's, uh, it, it, it's, the, it's, oh, it, it's basically going to be just nothing but dad jokes so like it's like man i, I was like i hope um uh, i get something to eat soon after the podcast because i'm pretty hungry it's like oh hi pretty hungry <laughs> hey it's over i, I just stopped but donating you think a so pretty you should try to date her <laughs> i fucking both of you need to shut the fuck up right now <laughs> okay look can i can i tell a can i tell a joke okay what's the joke um so uh what why didn't the uh fungus need a roommate why his apartment didn't have mushroom. Uh, I, really like uh, <laughs> I like that one. I'm gonna go right. kill myself now, guys. You have a good. <laughs> oh, okay. I just disown you and you go and kill yourself, you fucking pussy. Uh, 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 Jim, to those people who don't know who you are, who yeah. the fuck are you? I was about to say, uh, like, tell the people who you are and what you do and what you like to uh, do. Well, my name is Jim Nobody. I do a little bit of everything. Um, I have uh, two YouTube channels. One is, I guess, review content. I try to make it funny and informative. And then the other one is a gameplay channel called Jim Nobody Plays With Himself because no one's really made that joke <laughs> with the Let's Play community. And I was like, I'm going to jump on that. I love it. I have three YouTube channels, if you think about it. With a crappy music channel that I'm not going to ever upload. <laughs> okay, you have four YouTube channels. Get the one that I'm also in. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I also edit for uh, for Dai Tamachi. Is that how you say it? Dai, Dai Tamachi. You've been working Dai with him. I'm, I'm, you... I'm, 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 I'm from Georgia, man. It's Tomogachi. <laughs> he's watching this right now. He's 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 disappointedly shaking his head. I'm sorry, Dai. I love D- you and your content. <laughs> Dai Dimensions? You. What? Dai Dimensions. <laughs> I, I forgot about that. I forgot that existed. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, edit for uh, his gameplay channel as well. I've been doing the Panzer Models. Uh, and and we also there, there's a Bendy in the Ink Machine playthrough coming. Oh, I don't know if we're allowed to talk about that. So if that's the case, then censor it, Joe. I'm sorry. God, no, he, annou- he announced it on his on the. I saw a post about it. Okay, if he announced, announced it, I, yes. If it's announced, I wouldn't yeah. say it. I wouldn't say it if it hadn't if I hadn't seen he had announced it. So. Okay. Yeah, you can. You can announce that. What, what did you say about not giving me my one dollar on Patreon, Don? I mean, John. Uh, it's Don. That's a different boy. <laughs> that's a different. That's a different boy. That's on this podcast. Dear it's like fusion ha between you, you and uh, Die. Okay. <laughs> oh God. Oh my I God. Mean, <laughs> you'll get a job at that point. That isn't video editing <laughs> you're for just other like people. Your, you're like in a feedback loop, paying yourself. Mm. Like, if I had all the subscribers that I would have, I'd ruin it in a fucking heartbeat. So I, <laughs> I could them. lose them all in a day. <laughs> <laughs> Just you wait. Just you fucking wait. I'm going to say something that'll... And it's the anime community, so anything I say could destroy my entire channel. Damn. <laughs> That's... Being well, an anti-tuber is hard. L- l- luckily... I don't have much of a channel, so I can say whatever the fuck I want. That's <laughs> true. Uh, so hey, um, boys, I got a few things I want to talk about, if that's all right with you. Yeah, well, you're probably old enough. <laughs> you're old enough, John. You could you could say whatever. <laughs> well, I mean, you can't oh, no. really say whatever. But... We left. John... Oh no, we left John alone, and he's only 22 years old. Ah! <laughs> you just see it just cuts to you just like running around in a in a target just like <laughs> like throwing clothes Wait, around a target you, you walk up to somebody and tug on their sh- why am i in a target you like tug on their shirt and you're like can you help me find my mommy <laughs> <laughs> you're like 22 <laughs> <laughs> that that i that, 
that actually reminds me of uh, this one time <laughs> that my that my sister was uh, was visiting us from Houston, and she's like seven years older than me. And what was really funny was that we actually went to Target, me, my mom, and my sister, and fucking, um, I like when we were like almost done shopping, I hear like my mom tells me is like, all right, I'm I'm gonna go pay for all this. Uh, watch your sister, and then like I just look behind me, and I just see my sister, just, like she hears that too, so she just like fucking runs into like a purse aisle and just like makes a weird ass like laugh. I just see her like flail into a bah! like oh, <laughs> just to like get you in trouble, I guess. <laughs> just like the I guess. Um, emphasize the whole thing that like she, my mom's telling me to watch my sister, my older sister. That's <laughs> fucking weird. I miss your, I miss you and your family. Back when I used to live in El Paso, fucking. The, the, all right, Silver is a giant. I want everybody to emphasize this right now. I don't think it's ever <laughs> established, but Silver is a fucking gigantic beast. I'm he is the ogre in every single hentai that you have ever watched. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I, I'm I'm 6'4", but god damn it, you just fucking reminded me of the, the thing from fucking Demo, where it's like, it's like, finally, an anime I can relate to. Uh, I could finally be with the belt, the belt buckle height love of my life, where he just, where he just um, splits me in half with this massive gorilla cock. Oh, <laughs> uh, but yes, I'm, I'm, I don't know why you mentioned that I'm big, <laughs> I mean, I'm a I'm a tall boy. Tall boy. <laughs> um, so for, I mean, over, like, I think we've been steering away from it in like these past episodes, but we always like to have a a topic on the podcast. Like, I mean, we could always talk about anything, but we always want something to fall back on to talk really about. Just, did yeah, we really just... anything this time? We just. <laughs> <laughs> You're the first guest where we're just shooting the shit. Oh, oh we just... fuck yeah. Yeah, we could just oh, shoot this. the shit. Like, I mean, I guess, like, another main topic would just be anything game-related. It doesn't really what matter. What <laughs> about that is, what if we have another... All right, let's say, for example, we have... Uh... All right, we had Salty DK Dan in an episode. He's mostly known for doing video editing for, for um, Robo Buddies. What I'm thinking is, what if we have Barry on for an episode, or another well-known video editor like Piggy, uh, Piggy Edits or whatever, and we're like, oh fuck, looks like we have to do uh, a voice uh, uh, video editing too or whatever without that's having the original person. like that. Like that's the thing. That's why I kind of don't like topic podcasts because of the fact that like, whenever we do. It, like it, like for some reason you always think of a topic that has to deal with something that our guests do mostly. I fucking well that's how we're supposed to do it, right? Fuck with Veronica, I really stretched the fucking topic. <laughs> I was like, uh, cartoons that uh, we watch as children. All right, got it. All right, I I said that. I asked that you dingus. <laughs> Oh, we like, were like, like adding adding adjectives. We <laughs> <laughs> like, don't know where the sentence is. You know that like uh, in the game, everybody says one word of the sentence. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, you haven't seen our bad commercials, but we'll talk about that later. Uh, oh god, but uh... <laughs> oh, that's that's a YouTube channel. I'm, gonna... <laughs> I'm just trying to right. think, like, what else? Like, would. <laughs> anything uh, that's not just thinking gaming but that's that's just the given it's a very given <laughs> I, I like i like the uh whatever the fuck <laughs> talk about format. i yeah, guess i guess how i guess what to bring up uh fucking what are you guys thoughts on the new pokemon generation <laughs> Damn it! I want. I we had a special guest. That I wanted to save that for, and you fucked it. Well, Bitch. If this helps. I really haven't kept up with it, so you just save it, and we'll move on. Oh, yeah, I don't care about Pokemon themselves. I, I only I, care I, about. I, I like Pokemon. I have a Pokemon Yellow Nuzlocke coming out soon. 
Oh. Next next week. So that's on the that's Jim it. Nobody Plays With Himself channel. Yes. Freak. Um, but I don't know. Like I haven't. I, I the only reason I know the third generation is because I did the Ruby Nuzlocke. Um, fucking shameless plug. I'm not trying to. <laughs> Ruby. No. I haven't like, really, I haven't always really kept up with Pokemon that much. Like I, I see that new stuff's coming out, and I'm like, oh, that looks cool, but I don't have that system, so fuck it. <laughs> oh, one, the only thing I'm really. Well, no, Jim, you're you're good though, because that at least at the end of every episode, we always like to just plug in anything our guests have. So you're good. <laughs> I wanted to talk more about the live action movie that you were in. Oh, those things? Oh, you were in a movie? That's, well, okay, it's a, and, and keep in mind, these are definitely B movies. Like, they're not, I'm not, this isn't like a fucking epic masterpiece or anything. Like, these aren't, there's parts about them where I watch and I'm like, that's not good. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I had a lot of fun doing it. They're called Gangsters and Zombies. It's a uh, feature-length mini-series, so there's three parts, um, and we filmed them around town here with this, these people I knew. And uh, the gag for me is, I, I'm, you gotta, you gotta count how many times I die in the, in the movie, because they would disguise me and kill me in, in new <laughs> ways. How I would suggest you would promote the movie is if you're doing a review, you can say that you can, do, you can say that we are one of the very few YouTube review boys that has actually been in a thing. Been in a shit movie? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the only real oh, You know I've what I really want to do? What I really want to do, but I don't know if I have the balls, because I'm... I, I, maybe one day. I'd like to just send it to Red Letter Media. <laughs> yes. <laughs> do it! <laughs> and, like, just see if it gets on a best of the worst. That would be funny. Will be on the best of the worst, and then you'll get like actual. If, if you got, if you get a chance, and and I'm talking to anybody watching and you two, for that matter, go watch Gangsters and Zombies one, two, and three. Yeah. Uh, one and two, uh, one, get through it. Two is a lot better than one, and three has a special place in my heart because I helped put that fucker together. <laughs> like my name is in the opening credits, so I'm like. Eh. Hmm. Well, yeah, hope, hopefully people who are watching will see that. And freaking, <laughs> John, you reminded me. There is someone else that I will never forget for some reason that at least showed up once in a movie. <laughs> Do you, uh, you guys ever heard of the this this old YouTube fellow? Well, he's not old, but I mean, like, he's been on YouTube for a while. The freaking Make Me Bad 35. Oh, uh, I think that loser used to be obsessed with. Was did he video where he was in the car and was just like super fucking obnoxious? I'm not sure. Okay. I, like, I, the words that, I recognize that name because I continue. As like 90% of YouTubers in, in the near the, in the early 2000s. Yeah, I remember. You're not wrong. Yeah, You're I, not wrong. I remember like one of the main things that like a lot of people knew him for was like uh, two things was one of them being like skits about a very like fucked up sounding t like wooden alligator and yeah, I don't remember that and I think like Bro, another another one was like some videos that he did where he just did like random ass shit with like his uh his voice audio at a very high pitch so people kept mistaking him for Fred even yeah, though he okay, wasn't. and he did the, like, I'm not Fred, this is, would if I made a Fred video, this is what I would it would be, and it was, like, better than any Fred video. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Why? yeah, I remember him. Yeah, he was... Why bring up... He, he was in, uh, it's because I would never forget that he made a video that he showed, like, one scene, the only scene that he was in in a movie, where he just, like, shakes the main character's hand and then just walks off. What movie was this? <laughs> I think it was a movie called Herpes Boy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, he did big things afterwards. He? Oh. Silver, uh, you're the only Make Me Bad 35 fan that still is alive. Uh, is, <laughs> I'm the lone survivor. Right uh, I, uh, I uh, qualify for senior citizen discount now. <laughs> <laughs> we should get him on the podcast. Make his career, dude. Family. Like I would fangirl a little bit. His career, like, that high family. school of me, you know, when I was in high school, when like 
it was before like YouTuber was even a thing. It was just like, here's this asshole who uploaded. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. We could totally get that loser in an episode of the podcast. <laughs> Not if he sees this now. I know, right? I mean, he's he's that still loser. Fuck them guys. He, he, I am Fred. He's still an amazing dude. Like I That's loved nice. watching so much of his shit. I think like, God, what was like the one like set of videos that I loved? I, it was God, really weird disorders or something like that. Where <laughs> and they were just like so fucking weird that I just couldn't stop laughing. One of them was just like waking up in the middle of the night to call your parents for something completely like stupid. And he just, you just see him like wake up, like looking around for his phone. And then like, he calls his mom and like, Damien, are you okay? What's wrong? And he just fucking yells penis at the top of his lungs. <laughs> I remember that one now. Oh no. Uh, did you guys ever watch Hyperboy? It was a Flash cartoon. Oh, that's, here's the thing. That sounds familiar. The only, like, only real, because my internet was fucking dog shit, so I couldn't really upload a lot of content on there. Or, not upload, I couldn't watch a lot of content right. on there, because it would always buffer. thing that I could really do was that guess it was just i watched ego raptor and like yeah Chris i watched Keel, a lot of ego raptor back in the Did, you ego. know it's kind of weird like there definitely feels like there's a difference between ego raptor and aaron hansen there is yeah you know what i mean like like that animator died in a fire a long time ago unfortunately <laughs> and i hate it because he was one of the best like animators in my opinion he's, he's amazing long. like i um I, I do think it's funny that they're like the rare occasions where he'll actually like acknowledge it on Game Grumps. I I yeah. remember like when him and Dan like they made fun of like the comments that are hating on them where like Dan just starts it off with like I miss John and then like <laughs> and then like Aaron's just like uh, I wonder why Aaron stopped animating. <laughs> I remember that. I think I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I really, like, the only thing I really would want to happen ever is if John does come back for, like, even just an episode, I just want all three of them on that couch. Oh, please. I would love that. It would be cool. Never, it's never going to happen, no, sadly. never, because John has standards. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh, shit. Not, not until we get him on this podcast and he can't have any more excuses. <laughs> No, I, like, get him on it's like he's been in it. talks with John Tron, dude, and he just keeps like, I don't really want to talk to you, dude. He's, <laughs> he's just like, yeah, yeah, I'll do it. I don't want to talk to this guy. He just won't fuck out. He got my number. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why he just found my email address somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I get. I right. this email. That, you know, like, I think that, I get these guests normally by dude. asking them on like their business email. Hey, can I fucking have you on this podcast? No, bitch. Ask Salty DK Dan. Dude. Everybody who's watching this, ask, go to DM Salty DK Dan and ask him how I got him. I literally jumped through his house. He screamed, <laughs> what the fuck are you doing in my house? I held a gun at gunpoint. I'm like, listen, bitch, you're going to be in the episode of the Randomized <laughs> Podcast. That is R-A-M-D-I Zer's Podcast. I forgot how to spell I. Uh, uh, there's Randomizer. Sharp <laughs> hard. Glass in my <laughs> but, but I can't spell it, but that's not the point. You're gonna be on it. <laughs> on the fucking podcast, or I'm gonna kill you in front of your family. And then, we're in cyberspace oh, right now. No, I don't no, understand no, it. Please. And then I jumped out, and then he did it, and that's how I got him on the podcast. John, John, you, you basically, you, you like it's it. I, I'm basically afraid now. Like, uh, well, like that makes me afraid of how you contacted chris because i'm just thinking that you told i that's all i did wait what what did you do <laughs> here all right listen here's how i message everybody hello there me and my associates have been a fan or are a fan of your content or have been for a very long time I if you are interested if you are interested in an episode of our podcasts we would love to have you on an episode if your schedule is too busy i completely understand and would like to have you to have a nice day 
in regards Mr. Cake Dragon Man. Basically, I'm just I don't okay. actually go to people's fucking houses and ask them, "Hey, faggot, you want to be in another no, more podcast?" No, no, I just me. see like they're brushing their teeth at night, you know. <laughs> and then like this shadow just like comes by and then just like you gonna be in my fucking podcast, right? <laughs> <laughs> no. I got Baraka by this. I will fucking kill Chris if you don't come to this podcast. No, it's because that's what I thought. He's the fucking joker, dude. He's the fucking joker. That's the other podcast. It's no, he's not dude, Please, dude, it's because that's what I actually thought that you would at least like message with Chris. That like we had your girlfriend on the podcast. Like, why not you come not on? Mention, listen, cunt. I did not mention Veronica in that entire email. Good, and like, cause no, Anything you, I did, I didn't know why you had to bring up to Veronica about like it's like. Uh, you you and Chris are, are a good couple. You fucking. <laughs> <laughs> because I can probably use that so fucking That's much. <laughs> like, Look, man, I'm not gonna be. It's because she was legitimately very charming when we were talking. I was like, damn, Chris is a lucky motherfucker. Yeah, Veronica's an awesome girl. Like, oh my god, but like when you brought up that, I'm like Jesus Christ, John. That's her personal like business, dude. <laughs> I mean, bill. Oh my god. <laughs> her Patreon, give her uh how much is rent in um I I don't know where the fuck she lives. Fucking oh, California. Is it L- is it LA? Yeah, it could, yeah it's freaking a thousand dollars. Right? Dude, in LA it's like fucking expensive as shit. Even yeah. like if it's just for an apartment. Or it's like a small house, it's gotta be expensive as hell. Bobby like trying to get you guys to move to LA or something or Denver. Yeah, he will. No, he wants to move to Denver. I don't know, like why. Do you want? He doesn't want to leave everybody. He wants everybody to move to Denver and have a house in Denver. <laughs> I mean, that would be you cool. Come here but... in Florida, because the rent is cheap. Where the streets are crawling with criminals, and I don't, don't want to live in Florida. In Florida. No one wants to live in Florida. <laughs> not even you. It's humid. And, like, you, you get a bunch of dude bros on the beach. Yeah, bro. Nice. <laughs> I've never seen dude bros, but I see a lot of crime. I <laughs> live in the bad part of the neighborhood. So I live in Oakland. I just want you guys to know that. Mm. Just trying to... I'm sorry. <laughs> get out of there somehow. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, hey, look. It's time for uh, an ad. From our sponsors, it's, it's time for another one of the, these. Does again. your butt hurt often? <laughs> <laughs> when you sit down, are you not satisfied with the an- anus Can you care? not sexually satisfy anyone, even yourself? Well, try. Do we... <laughs> Sorry? Or are you trying to fucking... Listen, asshole. This is my... This is... This is... This is my fucking spot. No, take and you're not gonna take, take it. Take it, baby. Is this like two fucking sponsors take just it. fighting each other for? <laughs> That's <first> funny. <laughs> no, this is my segment. I'm getting fucking paid for this voice work. Segment. I will you kick your me. ass. <laughs> I'm right in your asshole, and you're gonna like it. Call one eight hundred. Call one eight hundred. You're a fucking dead man. Hundred. <laughs> I fucking started this commercial. I'm gonna end it. Okay. Okay. This is a lot of numbers to type. <laughs> In a world, <laughs> in a world. you shut the fuck up and let me finish. <laughs> Listen to me, bitch. This is my ad. I'm getting this Game Grumps money. Do you understand me, my my, my dude? Get that fat Game Grumps check. <laughs> Eight ninety nine a month, which I can use for Crunchyroll Premium. Really bitch about playing video games. <laughs> Oh, that, that got just... a little too real. That's like everyone. That, that's all of that's, us. That is everyone. That is <laughs> that's every, that's every, me, that's you. That's this YouTube channel. That's your YouTube channel. That's going to be my YouTube channel. Everyone. I don't have to watch this shitty fucking movie, but I'm going to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm giving this one a 6 out of 10. I will the bitch about movies. Today's podcast is when shit gets too real. The, the topic of today's podcast is hypocrisy. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 
I'm, I'm still just in the corner crying. <laughs> he doesn't know how to. He doesn't know how to deal with this. <laughs> no, and also like, it also I was just like on the edge of my seat, like listening to you guys too and laughing while I'm also, like, finally getting, uh, a fucking like I I got something from a friend. I don't want to say specifics. But I am excited, and I was happy. But now I am, I am like fully in now. God damn it! A sponsorship? You, you're present now. No. Are you editing for Game Theory? No, that, dude. That like, that would actually be pretty cool. Like, if I at least like did something know, on man. Game Theory. If oh, bro. I okay. I, so I, I can't I have stand Matt friends. Pat's voice enough. Stand that pack period. Here's the thing. I feel like, well, bad. here's the thing. Some, the thing actually. Sometimes his voice actually sounds very pleasing. I don't know why. Like he, he sounds like. I mean, he sounds like it, but I can tell. Like he, to me, he looks handsome. Some, no, I, he's a handsome guy. Like I, I won't disagree I'd with that. Him. I'm, I'm not gay. Like, yeah, you know, it's pretty. It's pretty. Yes, yeah, that'd be like yeah, fat pet. Probably let make a good track. Let me see your fat sack. <laughs> oh gee, <laughs> come on, Matt Pat, show us your fat sack. <laughs> little boy pussy, Matt Pat. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking see the little boy. Frank, yeah. <laughs> I got a game theory for you. <laughs> oh no! This is actually me, Matt Pat Matthew Patrick. How theory. big does your cock have to be to stick it in? <laughs> Uh, boy. Uh, well, there goes uh, any chance we have of ever working with Matt Pat. <laughs> Who else do we want to mark up this list? We knocked off the Game Grumps. <laughs> we mocked, we're marked off John Tron. Oh, no, John Tron's just fucking... not going to work with us because <laughs> Kate keeps calling him. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, you're there, John Tron. <laughs> that's, why ch- that's why I changed his opening because you were like, I hate the fucking opening. <laughs> I, I told him to change the opening. You don't even do fucking video games anymore. Why do you got a video? <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, I love John Tron. Please, if y'all ever watch this, anyone that reviews content only did it because John Tron did it. Let's be fucking real here. Well, to honestly, what really inspired me to start doing anything with YouTube was Game Grumps. Okay. Yeah. Boy, how how that fucking turned for you. Right. Well, I still I still have a lot of respect for both of them. I feel like they're doing yeah. good things. I just feel like they're not playing anything worth a damn, and I, it just feels too clickbaity, and I don't feel like they're enjoying it anymore. But when I do watch I haven't it, enjoyed it in, since two, since like July of two thousand eight. Yeah. <laughs> fucking you know before John. Uh, before Game Grumps even started, there was like, I hate Game Grumps. I hate doing Game Grumps. <laughs> I hate Game Grumps. No, What's you know Game Grumps? Do you remember that tweet that uh, Aaron posted a long time ago that it was like, if I'm ever in a Let's Play show, kill me? <laughs> oh my god, yeah. <laughs> and now he's like, the Let's Play show. <laughs> That's all he is. You're the Let's Play man. Now. And he built, oh, like, I think I'm the he ba- Game Boy. He basically built an empire on that now, too. Like, Dude, I, hate it. I hate it when like like I got one of uh one of my early videos got accused of being a game grumps for ball because it was like uh it was the Mega Man video Mega Man on DOS and uh I, I remember it was like because I like got mad and left the room and I'm like who re- game grumps was the first fuckers to do that calm down oh, <laughs> fucking ABGM <laughs> no for shit one. no shit yeah. I think I literally there was a joke that I pretty much, the, there is no fucking music, I'm pretty sure AV something like that before I did. <laughs> but, I don't know. I don't, there's no comedy I'm original. I'm very whatever. picky when it comes to dumb shit and I know my dumb shit. <laughs> <laughs> right, dumb kids. shit connoisseur. Alright, kids. Uh, Silver has a story to tell. Wait, what? Uh, on the <laughs> Wait, I just put well, you actually, on the spot. Well, actually, like, yeah, man, you remember? You were... <laughs> Well, actually, fucking, when we brought up John, John Tron, for some reason, I will never forget that I had a dream that, like, I, I went into a fucking 7-Eleven, and I just saw, and I just see, like, John hiding, like, in the, in the 7-Eleven, I'm like, the fuck? Is it, like, one of the, you think it's one of those dreams where it happens later in the future? Because I've had those happen to me a lot. 
<laughs> reoccurring dream is that I keep driving off of a cliff and, and falling to my death. Oh wow! Well, don't don't do that. I'm not going to, but it's I I don't drive off the cliff. It literally I literally spiral out of control and drive off the cliff. There's liter it's literally happened like ten times in my life in different variations, but it's always the same fucking cliff. Stay away from that <laughs> cliff. That you've never like, seen in real life. The cliff is all right. So it's not a cliff; it's more like a road. And like on the bot on the side, there's like a, a giant like the ocean or whatever the fuck. So it's like uh, I don't know if it's a cliff or if it's called something else other than the road. I guess, I guess it's like a that's a cliff. If, even if it drops down to yeah. The ocean. I always one time I imagined I was a small baby what? brother Giuliano. Was, it, was uh, the small baby back. driving? Because that would explain the crash fucking car and then we drove off the cliff the one time was just a normal man i was driving off the cliff one time uh and uh, i was going to brony con and i drove off a cliff uh maybe, maybe it has something to do with when you're stressed <laughs> and you're like i'd rather fucking just drive off this cliff <laughs> I'd rather drive off this fucking cliff than be a goddamn brony hello there bitch. Like, like i i don't know why like it just it, it just keeps reoccurring in my head whenever you're saying that. Just like in all of your dreams, I like, it just goes off normally, and then it, it just cuts to that one clip of like that red car just driving off a cliff. No, <laughs> <laughs> no, it's always a Volkswagen like fucking van or minivan or some shit. <laughs> it's a shitty dark green piece of shit van. A, a that mini- had road. What are you a soccer mom? I don't know. Uh, maybe. Really, this really has become dad jokes, the episode. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of fuck. Uh, uh, hey, do you guys, uh, do you guys want to, you, you guys want to maybe talk about uh, dreams y'all had? Dreams that might essentially mean your death? I don't know. I, I had a, I'm trying to think of a dream. It's like interesting to talk about. I'm trying to think yeah, of some too. I, um, I had a dream once where I was floating. And there it is. <laughs> very, Woo! very fascinating, Jim. I've got nothing. I've really got nothing right now. Sorry. What about you, Silver? I. I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. Very impressive. I, I, I'm A plus. Ow. Oh, oh. Cr- <laughs> you guys ever seen Blade Runner? Uh, Some of it, yes. I, I think it's kind of overrated, but I get why people like it. Yeah, I, I'll, I'll agree with you. I, I don't know if I like it. I like parts about it, but I really don't like other parts about it. Very, like, uh, not, what the fuck's the word? Uh, slow. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, fuck me. It's so slow. I mean, it makes uh, 2001 visually. look like fucking Die Hard. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> think about. Um. So hey guys. Uh. But like for me. Say oh hey guys. Like I was already in the middle of something. For me, <laughs> that movie. You know, let you go, man. I wasn't gonna stop. Um, with me, that movie is pretty hit or miss. I guess uh, never but. Miss, huh? End your life right now. <laughs> right now. This isn't this isn't a threat. This is a fucking promise. I'm gonna bring that shit here. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. I expect this from Bobby or Don or Jake, but not you. You're supposed <laughs> to be the fucking person that I know would never fucking reference that sh- what, what shitty reference. Mean? The, the, oh no. Oh. Yeah, now Jim wants to know about it. Go yeah, ahead, explain the meaning. Just do it again. Go ahead. Let's let's ruin everyone else's life some more. <laughs> Dude, should I just like send a video? Because I rarely even reference it. In all honesty. And you chose today. <laughs> you chose today when I was talking of doing a very. The... Well, just fuck it. I don't... Uh, <laughs> do you know? All right. Well, in relation to that shitty, fucking terrible. Bullshit meme, but the cosplayer's nice. Uh, do you know what Love Live is? Nope. <laughs> Let's keep it that way. <laughs> I'm, gonna stay, uh, I'm gonna stay a, a, a clean, 
clean. This is, this is me and my personal opinion. Love Live is a fucking gateway drug to uh, high school K-pop, J-pop anime bullshit. Yeah, I don't like that. I'm gonna say this right now. It needs to go away. It is needs it, to. Is it okay go... that I like Soul Eater? No, Soul Eater is good. No. Soul Eater is fine. I like Soul Eater, but Ruby tried to be Soul Eater and is failing miserably. <laughs> you know, I, you know, you talk about Ruby a lot. I don't think I'll ever watch it. Mm. It just doesn't interest me. Don't I love you, man. But <laughs> I'm you don't. I am giving you the. Listen, I'm gonna give me to get out of get out of Ruby free card. <laughs> <laughs> Ruby, free card. Ruby is only all right, volumes one through three is good, and literally after that is a downward spiral. Downward of spiral. Shipping downward and... spiral. Downward spiral. And <laughs> woman, we need to get you on this podcast too. <laughs> Yes. If you're watching this, please, uh, Daddy, uh, come join this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> um, Randomizer podcast. Next episode, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. Oh, next episode. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you sounded like the Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> That's what you're going Kyle for. Now. Yeah. Oh, speaking of which, fucking Joseph, uh, remember the time. I was gonna have my my actual legitimate voice actor friend come on this podcast. And you're like, oh no, I don't know what anime they were in. And I, I'm gonna let you know. Wait, no, you mean uh, one of the chicks from Ruby? Oh, bitch! Uh, an actual anime. <laughs> no, no offense to Ruby. <laughs> it's making it's probably making more money than Goblin Slayer. But I mean, one of the main characters that... in Goblin. Yeah, that's okay. You told me. No, I, I, I told you. Like, just try, cause like you. T- yeah, you- I'm gonna message. All right, uh, not making any promises, but I might have our first industry guest coming very soon. But I have another list of fucking guests that we really need to get first, and I don't think it'll be fair. Yeah. Hopefully, something happens. But anyway, um, I have a, I have an idea that I've wanted to share with everybody for a long time. And I want all of you to listen. <laughs> oh, Relax. Okay. If this is animated. Uh, sorry, animator, but you're going to have to do a lot of frames when I tell you all the story. <laughs> Stop. Uh. Back animator. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Okay. Am I the animator? I can't animate. If, if there's an animator that's going... Uh, yeah, shut up. Okay, so... <laughs> um, damn it. A video that I've wanted to do, or something I've wanted to do for a very long time... Jack off. Okay, everybody, that's the animation. That's the that's the story I wanted to tell. Jack off. I was gonna say drugs are bad for you, Cake. You can't. Do drugs. <laughs> you can do drugs. drugs. <laughs> that's bad. Well, it depends. It do. depends on who you buy from. You don't get the shitty shit, and then you fuck. <laughs> uh, Attention, uh, kids. Do not do drugs. I'm not advocating drug use. <laughs> drugs yeah, buy it. Me. Okay. Don't buy drugs. Don't I'm looking drugs. at me. So, so not, can I tell you guys a skit I really want to do, but I don't know how yes. I, I would do it. Do it. So, Go for so it. So I want to. I want to do a skit about a Russian KGB agent who's trying to convince people he's not KGB, but his initial his initials are KGB. So he's like. No, no, I'm not KGB, but you, but my name K. You see where it could you, you know. <laughs> Why well, haven't you done it yet? I, I got nothing to put it in. I like I don't know what I would put it in. Or, I just it's some nobody. Stupid, I Fuck it. Like. It's been dead for several years. A year, thank you. <laughs> you sounded so pissed. I don't really care. <laughs> it, it has been. I just had other things come along, man, and it's like. It's really hard to make a video for a channel and like spend hours and hours and it get like 100 views, you know? Like, that's why I kind of like the Let's Play channel more because I don't really give a fuck if anybody like, watches it or not. What you see like, is what you get. It's still, yeah. it's still what makes us all the, the hidden gems of YouTube. We at least yeah, like right. what we're doing. We put a lot of work and effort into it, but not many people right. would watch us sometimes. <laughs> Right. And sometimes you'll have to do just a leafy is here and make the laziest content ever. 
while shit talking another bigger, more successful YouTuber like, in the hope <laughs> of the fact that they'll be stupid enough to actually respond to your bullshit, thus getting you even more views than you would normally get if you talked about another fucking topic. Well, there's at probably all are on this website now. Aren't we? <laughs> look at look at this Here person right it. here. I literally can't stand this person right now. So, I so honestly, I get, does that mean we're gonna? Dude, we've shit talked everyone so far. Does that mean that we're famous now? <laughs> That's how it would normally go, but if it's enough, it, you know, it's not in the format that you're supposed to do. Uh, Silver is supposed to be playing Surf on CSGO, and then <laughs> up to the cringiest person that they've ever seen in their entire life, and and look at like backlogs of this really bad videos. This person is literally the worst. Do you see this video they posted in 2007? Like, that didn't <laughs> even crop it right. It. That's how you get money. That's how you get bitches. That's how you get everything. Remember that picture of that fat YouTube, them fat YouTube bitches. <laughs> fat YouTube bitches. Remember when uh, that picture of Leafy when he was eating someone's ass and just posted it on Instagram? What? It was literally on. Uh, I <laughs> shit you not. A picture of Leafy is here, eating ass <laughs> on his Instagram. Oh my god! It was a weird flex. <laughs> Guess that's kind of what it was. Was it? He's like, you guys are eating cereal. I'm just eating ass. His what? nose deep in some girl's asshole. <laughs> He'll be proud of himself. And he's in stocks now, I guess. So he's he's definitely just done all the bullshit. He even admitted in the interview with Keemstar. It's another he did everything for money. Keemstar is a waste of a human. I don't give a fuck if he hates me or not. <laughs> <laughs> he could see this. Go suck a dick, that. Keemstar. <laughs> he didn't promote the Froyo Bros when I fucking asked him to promote the Froyo Bros. Fuck him. <laughs> I, w I wish he'd drive off of a cliff. <laughs> Jesus. No. Jesus. no we're not. <laughs> la, la, la. No, no. If anyone's a fan of Keemstar, I'm sorry. I'm not sorry if you're offended. I'm just sorry. <laughs> Get some help. <laughs> so I'm Michael Jordan. Stop it. Get some help. Stop it. <laughs> I love Killer Keemstar. Keemstar. Just don't. Not even. Just stop. <laughs> McDonald's wanted McDonald's. me to tell you all about Killer Keemstar. Fuck him. <laughs> Fuck him. <laughs> Fuck him. Right in his silly ass. <laughs> uh, it, he McDonald's, can, can I get my check now? I want to go home. I well, want to I became a uh, Mitch Hedberg. Billions you know? of wives and my billions of small children. <laughs> billions and billions of small children. <laughs> <laughs> the brain is composed of millions and millions of small children. <laughs> Sounds <laughs> all <awful>. screaming <laughs> and screaming. <laughs> Constantly <laughs> asking for their mommies. <laughs> Constantly <laughs> asking, do you have games on your phone? <laughs> Can I, have, can I have some ice cream? <laughs> Want ice cream, mommy? Please, mommy. When, when, when the earth cracks open and hell invades, it'll just be a oh, bunch no, of little no. children going, Can oh, you oh, oh, I want to play games. <laughs> Hyped up on play red dye. That would be terrifying. You know how, like, in some shows, like, bees or whatever the fuck would form into, like, human hands and shit? <laughs> What if they did that, both small children, and they would just attack random cities? No, no, even worse, a human-child-bee hybrid. Yeah. Oh my god. Like, they're, <laughs> that is they're horrifying. Human, they look like human children, thing. but they're bees as well, and they're like the size of a human child. Oh my god! They're That's awful, like, Tim! So basically, the, the, the queens from Fallout. Sure, I never played Fallout. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I've, I've heard good things. I've just never gotten around to it. Silver here is the only person who likes Fallout 76. Well, I mean, I I have a friend that also, like, one of the only friends that I actually play Fallout 76 on, but yeah. Okay, Silver and his friend are the only people that have liked Fallout 76. Hey, hey, hey. It, it, it takes a big man to admit a game is shit. It takes a bigger man to say that a game is shit and they still enjoy playing it. <laughs> That's true. That's cool. I can, I can, I can respect that. <laughs> I mean, I've played Sonic the Hedgehog and even... i played Sonic 06 and even I have to say that it's less buggy than dude, Fallout 76. Dude, it's, dude Sonic, Sonic 06 was something. It was extremely <laughs> glitchy. It was horrible. But like the story was awkward. 
but goddamn, it's, it's the room of video games. Basically, and but goddamn, no. the the video music games. the music was fucking amazing though. I gotta say, it's a Sonic yeah, game. You know that seems to be a theme with Sonic games. Like they're awful, but the music is like pretty good. And see, all of them are awful. I'm gonna uh, be one of the very well, few. Well, like even like Sonic 3D Blast. Like I, I was hate talking. That to, I was talking to Billiam a few years back, and like while we were at Anime EY. The, the, we were talking about Sonic the Hedgehog, and he gave he, he th when Forces came out, I gave it a seven. He gave it a six. I was kind of like, you know what, uh, six point five. Hmm. That we had. Oh, know. hold it, John. I I kind of had an idea. I, just before I forget, cause I wanted to tell you, I wanna. I had an idea for an episode where like, the, like I want to have like a bunch of guests, but like. The three that I'm thinking of at the moment, and like anyone else who wants to join in, I just want to have like freaking Dan, Die, and hopefully if we can actually get him, the freaking uh, the gamers, the gamer monkeys or whatever his name is, the the one animator that mostly does uh, JoJo stuff. I just want to have like a whole yeah. podcast where we just talk about JoJo. <laughs> it's just yeah, fuck yeah, let's get uh. Uh, let's let's torture Salty DK Dan once again by talking about uh, JoJo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, I think that'll be very interesting. <laughs> um, I am all right. If we're talking about JoJo right now, I'm still in part two. I'm checking out. You're checking, checking out. out. <laughs> it's like fuck. Oh, they're talking about JoJo. I'm out of here. Well, I, I haven't seen it, so I'm just like. I, I know it exists, I guess. I know it's good from what I've heard, but it. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I watched to... Umbrella Academy. Did y'all see that? I've heard of that. I actually want to see it. Pretty good. I enjoyed it. It's got some like, it's got some Netflix series moments. If you get what I'm saying, where it's like it's Alex know. in it. I mean, it's Alice in it. Alice. Good Alice. dumb cunt from all of the uh, Resident Evil movies. Oh no, she's not. I don't think. Huh. No? Now, then I'm gonna have to watch it, because she's awful. <laughs> Jesus. She's fucking the main reason yeah, why Resi was what it was for live-action movies. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I don't know how it made money. <laughs> Name recognition. Basically. A lot, yeah, of, ga but, a lot of gamers would see it. I mean, how, how does fucking Transformers make money constantly? Like, there hasn't been... I know. Ar arguably, none of those movies are good. Michael Bay. In. Michael Bay's good. Cash cow. Exploding cow. This summer, <laughs> Michael Bay is in my ass. I know I was going to say. <laughs> this summer, Michael Bay, inside, you <laughs> are Michael Bay. You are this, Michael Bay. This summer, Michael Bay's newest film, Gay Overtones. Check, check it out on Pornhub, where you can see the sequel, Michael Bay POV. <laughs> Michael Bay's shower cam. Oh my god. AJ's shower cam. Watch it. What are you see? doing in here? <laughs> <laughs> see how... Uh, the name Ray J. I'm making art, honey. Just. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you a billion dollars if I see what? I'll give you a million dollars. Just stand there and look pretty. <laughs> Watch Michael Bay get sued. <laughs> you see this bar of soap? Yeah. Be Shut up your ass. If you drop it, there'll be an explosion in your anus. <laughs> We've rigged you. We've rigged your anus to explode if you bend over, Mr. <laughs> 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 Mr. the Bay. right moment that when the camera goes by. <laughs> what is, what is also this? if michael bay is watching that this fuck you too <laughs> oh i just like people to know where i stand with them you know? well everyone fucking stands that way with him ever since he gave the rights to bumblebee it's literally he stopped getting hate just due to the fact that he decided to give up <laughs> they, they were like all right, we don't hate Michael Bay anymore. He decided to quit. <laughs> he's cool. Is he now. still? Is he still making movies, uh, Silver? I'm. I don't know. <laughs> of course, he's still making movies, but I wonder if he's still doing. Is he's gonna do the Transformers? Though. You know what I wish Little they beats. would do? 
Come mm. up with new ideas. Oh, Jim, you're <laughs> fucking... St- that, that might be a controversial thought, but... <laughs> it might be. Yeah, I like idea. new things. <laughs> like, I'm so fucking sick of Star Wars, I could scream. <laughs> what? Well, Going going on to that topic, just like of live action movies, and I bet you guys may know where I'm going with this. What are you guys' thoughts on like a lot of the, a lot of the live action remakes that Disney's coming uh, out with? Uh, <laughs> I would have more fun watching myself vomit, <laughs> like like having an out of body experience and watching myself vomit. Would be more fun. And, I, <laughs> I, I've never seen any of them. They look like shameless cash cows. They don't look interesting. They don't look like they're doing anything new. Okay, I'll say this. Like a tax write-off and a paycheck for everybody involved. I will give you guys a... Um, how to make a remake good. You, you, you know what Was I want? It? I want the original cut for the Black Cauldron release. Oh. The stu- one that... Dude, cut to no, shreds. no one likes that fucking movie. Shut up. I like that movie, so you can get over it. Didn't Disney? Our, not- our, the hero of that movie is so fucking bad. I love him. <laughs> he sucks. Okay. Okay. I just want to like okay. help him. <laughs> Come on, man. It's okay. For, for, for people that uh, know who I am, I have a very awful track record with good boys in certain animation. I'm the guy that likes Minetta from My Hero Academia. I'm the guy that likes fucking Randall from Recess. I'm the guy that likes the worst character in the thing that you are currently watching right <laughs> fucking now. I love him. But that kid is not that bad. I have seen worse. Oh, yeah, definitely. But he is just sort of like bumbling and like a jerk. <laughs> like, a jerk? He is kind of a jerk at the, when when he like talks to Princess can't pronounce her name. Look, I'm aware there's problems with the movie. I just love the world. Like when it starts off and it's got the fucking Horn King and he's like and it's like got Gandalf's voice from the old Hobbit movie. And it seems as if it was trying to be a series because I don't think that was the end of their story. Uh, no. It, apparently there was an a, um. There was a big like to do in Disney, and this movie had taken for forever. And there was a new... I don't remember his name. I think it was Katzenberg. Um, Katzenberg. Yeah. He was in charge, and he they showed him Black Cauldron, and he just was like, cut some of these. You, know, you gotta cut this and cut this. And the animators were like, we can't do that. Like, this is not gonna make any sense. So Katz, he just went himself and started making the cuts, like, to the original stuff. So there was, like, a lot more to that movie that was apparently a lot darker, like... Like, there was a scene where, like, uh, flesh melted off of bones, which, I don't know. That would have been cool for Disney to push the envelope like that back in the day. Uh, They did. uh, Getting back... I would love it if they did a remake of... uh, They just showed a remake of The Black Cauldron, and then after the fucking trailer, there's just a thing that says there's November, and then instead of showing the stars of it or whatever, they just say, fuck you, Jim. (laughs) (laughs) It specifically is... gonna be exactly the same <laughs> and like they just make it sound like the that one announcer voice that they have in south park's like it's like coming january 20 something fuck you <laughs> fuck you <laughs> jim nobody <laughs> fuck you jim nobody you specifically i know what <laughs> likes this movie why do you <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, the, no, the answer to that is i may have been a an- drug this morning <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck how did this go Rob Schneider is Bambi. (laughs) Bambi. Oh, I can't wait for the Dumbo remake. Aren't you guys excited? Are you guys excited to have my fucking childhood spoon-fed back to me? Yeah, I can't wait. (laughs) (laughs) We ran out of original content. I don't even have to chew it because it's already been thrown up. That's what that CG (laughs) looks like. I'm a dick, guys. I'm sorry. I really don't <laughs> like. I wish Disney would make new stuff. When they make new like, stuff, it's good. Replace yeah, them. I like Zootopia a lot. I thought that was a good movie. Uh, I well, didn't I've see actually... Moana. Moana? Yeah, I didn't see that, but it looked fine. Moana. Uh, I like yeah. Moana looked cool. I I saw like like a little bit more than half of the movie. I liked it. 
Yeah, it, it looked good. Like, I think I would enjoy it if I did watch it. Um, I didn't like Frozen, but I don't... And I, and that's just... I don't think... It, I, I don't like it, but I don't think it's bad. It's just Let It Go got run into the ground for me. If I never hear that song again, it'll be insane. This will be a good spot to find some ingredients. Oh, my God. The freaking... <laughs> are you, are you um, doing a King Hearts reference? Yeah. <laughs> um, Arendelle, or whatever the fuck that place is, is the worst world... In Kingdom Hearts 3. Uh, I, might, yeah, uh, I, I might do a Kingdom Hearts 1 playthrough on my... But, oh, do I'll a review of it, pussy. If I do, it'll be after I do a series. So hmm. I can, like, release them in tandem. That's what That's I want to do. That's smart. That's smart. It's a smart thing. I'm a smart boy sometimes. <laughs> smart! Wait, so, I'm, I'm trying to think... How many have how many live action Disney movies have they at least teased and pumped out in the past like year I've... or two? Like there's there's Mulan, there's Aladdin, there's Kim Possible, there's Dumbo. What else? No, no, no. Impossible does not fucking count. You know there's a movie I can't released? wait for because it's gonna be hot garbage. Which one? Sonic. Oh my god. <laughs> It's gonna be so terrible. I can't wait. It's gonna did, be Batman versus Superman did, bad. Did you see like Coffee, the? Where are you? Did Did you see the like the supposed like synopsis of the of the movie? Like what's it what it's gonna be about? No. Okay, so th this is what I saw from uh, a post that I saw from uh, mine and uh, John's uh, friend Austin that apparently. Hey, what? Before you get, before you start talking about it, can you play the? Yeah, uh, you played Sonic Adventure two, obviously, right? Who me or, or Jim? Both of you, but uh, yeah, Silver. Yes. Sonic. Yes, I have. I actually yes, like Sonic have. Adventure two. When you, read, when you read the when you read the synopsis, can you give the, the synopsis? You know when you the game, you hear the. Da, da, da. Can you play that while you're reading the synopsis right now? <laughs> Maybe I. <laughs> You may need to be more specific after this, but uh, I'll send, I'll send the song. Oh, okay. Um, so apparently, I like actually what I feel like I should do is I should read it verbatim. So I'm I may Step like <laughs> so I should so I should possibly like look for the post. It's on Instagram, so I don't think I could send it. Um, it as Sonic or like like be very like well bro when you're reading it no no i don't want to i i want to just sound like i, I can do that i do it. like I, it's because i, I, I want to sound like a legitimate like edgy narrator but like okay do it hold do on it. i'm trying to find the post that my <laughs> that he put just because it sounds so stupid if this is what the actual movie's gonna be about um, i think sonic himself looks like a cutie uh no joke I, I like his design in the movie because it could have been way worse. Really? His design? He looks uh, like he, somebody tried to draw Sonic in Photoshop. <laughs> it. But you know what? It's way better than what I thought it was going to be, which was going to be the man child that fucking Mikey, Moogie Mikey made. Uh, the movie animation. Movie, 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 movie. Where the fuck did he put this? Was it that like a while back? Like yeah, from what I yeah, when they had the synopsis and had everything else, it was like completely and utterly, utterly like hidden. Damn it, Austin! You you fucko! Hold on, I don't know if he He's put not... it like in his story and it went. No, oh, I found it! I found it! Here it is. Okay, Here, here's the actual what is supposedly the the plot. To the Sonic live action movie. Uh, wait, okay, here we go. A cop in a rural town of Green Hills will help Sonic escape the government who is looking to capture him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I broke down there just because of how fucking bad that sounds. <laughs> like, we're gonna beat. Don't worry, we're gonna beat the government, man! Wow. <laughs> Officer, you gotta help me <laughs> escape the government! Uh Officer, will you help me escape the government? I am the government. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> the fastest like, thing alive. I'll escape these taxes. No, I could. I could imagine like <laughs> the officer would actually be like that. It's like it's like you know I actually work for the government, but I see your point, and I will help you, Sonic the Hedgehog. 
Sonic the He's like, he, you, you know the character models in Sonic 06 when they're just like, they don't stop moving? They look, <laughs> yes. He's doing that. It's like, I will help you, Sonic. <laughs> yeah, and like in, in reality, all you hear them just go is, hey. 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 <laughs> uh, Media Nuts' favorite game of all time. Not even I'm fast enough to outrun the man. Not even, not even wow, I. Wow. I God damn, I can't say it. I'm so <laughs> fucking tired. <tight. laughs> Blame these taxpayers. You, you just hear like a lot of like wacky. Paying taxes is for dickheads. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even have it. Like they're they're making a lot of like childhood like video game and cartoon <laughs> characters like a little bit more adult kind of like how they're doing with the. With the Detective <laughs> Pikachu thing, how, like, people are so surprised just because he says hell once. Get me the hell out of here. I mean, these kids have been cussing on Modern Warfare. I mean, that that is true. <laughs> what, is, what is the... What is the night, yeah. Wait. That's, that's the pot track. I, I'm, I'm getting some, some cutoffs here. Hold on. See what's going on. Did you guys ever watch uh, Sonic for Hire? I saw some. I saw some episodes. It's, eh, it's okay. <laughs> Only his college or, or dorkly or whoever the fuck trying way too hard. I. Who was it that did that? I don't remember. I actually. I it was definitely. Really it was the it. Uh, It was it definitely was the dorkly. It was definitely the dorkly cast because okay. like. That yeah. Tails is in everything that Dorkly does whenever it comes yeah. to the parodies of Tails. Yeah. Not bad boy, but definitely someone who... I don't know. Good fun. fun. Oh, you know what a, a friendship test uh, like, is for me when I meet someone new? Hmm. Um, I show them uh, Hellbender's Applepalooza, and if they don't like it, we can't be friends. Oh my god. <laughs> That's why me and Silver became friends. Dude, I'm still waiting on more, like, episodes of that to come out. It'll never happen, oh, but me too. Oh, do I have bad news for you? <laughs> it's n it's it, been fucking ten years almost. It's, it's not, not gonna not, happen. It's not gonna fucking happen. I can't wait. <laughs> uh, if we ever have Chris on, I can't wait for him to spell it out for you. That's never gonna fucking no, happen. No, no. Uh, can, can you finish this uh, synopsis? Please. Actually, please. No, that's that's all it said. That's, that's it? That's oh, it. so it's, he's, he's in Green Hill fight the government, man. Basically, that's all it says. A cop in a rural town of Green Hills will uh, help Sonic escape no from the government God. who is looking to capture him. Funny bitches. I'm gonna look for the actual Sonic the Hedgehog movie synopsis on Wikipedia. <laughs> I'm gonna go burn my Genesis because Sonic is ruined forever. <laughs> ruined forever. Sega is rolling in their graves. I, I don't know why when, when we were just saying about like the Hellbenders never have anything again. I don't know why it just fucking reminded me of the Filthy Frank. They just like top five things you didn't know about the Holocaust. Number one, it it <laughs> didn't happen. Thing number one, it never happened. Have you ever <laughs> had that moment? That makes me think of this. You ever had that moment where you're hanging out with someone and they're like, they're really cool, you're having a good time, and then they just do something where you're like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> like, okay. you're, like, like yeah, they say that's... something incredibly racist, sexist, and you're just like, uh... <laughs> <laughs> um... Okay, okay so I found the synopsis, the synopsis, and here's what it, I, I think <laughs> reads now. <laughs> A small town sheriff, Tom Witch, San Francisco. You, John, you, you kept you kept cutting off on my end. Like it was hard for some reason. My bad. Maybe because of how loud I was being. Anyway, um, a small town sheriff named Tom Wachowski journeys to fucking San Francisco to assist Sonic, an anthropomorphic blue hedgehog who can run incredible speeds in his battle against Doctor Robotnik, and that's the synopsis. The, the character. In Sega's, in Sega's journey to completely destroy their mascot. Dude, yeah. Dude, I, I gotta say, like, with Sonic, they need to be more fucking original because it's always Eggman. It's, it's, it's. I know Eggman's like the, the number one, like, themed villain for Sonic, but come on. They could. They, like, I know that they've made more, like, villains, but it's always Eggman for some reason. Like, when I got Sonic Generations. 
I'm just like, oh crap, this this villain looks really cool. He's all like dark and well, creepy looking. Well, and then like, you know, it's, and then you just fucking realize it's just a robot. Like, well, same from with uh, Eggman. Zelda and Ganondorf. I can't stand anytime Ganondorf's the villain. In at at least game. I'm just like, oh okay. <laughs> at least with Zelda, uh, I can I can think of of like other like villains that actually played big roles yeah. besides well, and, Ganon. And also it has a lot to do with the majority of those games are good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cause I mean, like, that... cause like with Zelda besides Ganon, like I can think of like Girahim, Zant, fucking uh, Majora, the, Majora, the, that one dude with, from a link between worlds, Yuga, I think uh, what his name what's was. What's his name? Uh, it, Vadia. I thought it was Yuga for some reason. Oh no, Link Between Worlds. I was thinking of um Link to the Past. <laughs> not Link to the Past, uh Four Swords Adventure. Oh, As okay. But yeah. Uh, you guys want to hear the fucking uh how they describe every character so guys, far that's being you, developed? You guys want to hear a bathroom joke? I was kidding, what, what's up? Okay, so Ben Schwartz is going to play a Sonic the Hedgehog, an anthropomorphic juvenile delinquent blue hedgehog who can run it. Oh god, it's Super Dragon Ball Sonic Revolution Steve. all over again. And, it's, and is on the run from the government, like what you just said. He's on the run from the government. <laughs> I was just like, why? Dude, <laughs> Your career it, that will be ruined. Dude, James Martin. <laughs> Dude, it's as if they got, like, the key plot point to E.T. and put it into Sonic. Listen, I think this movie is going to be a joke. <laughs> they don't yeah. give a fuck about this movie. Uh, this like is a, a fucking this nine is million do- $90 million shit post. They're trying to kill Sonic. Oh, yeah. They don't like Did Sonic you anymore. Work? They're out of ideas. They're like, he goes fast. Whatever. You guys know <laughs> this movie is going to cost $90 million? I don't get surprised by shit like it's that. The budget. Fuck it. The Fuck it. Teen Titans Go to the movies costed less than this, and it made their budget. Wow. Is it... I'm Wachowski, the newly appointed sheriff of Green Hills, who befriends Sonic and AIDS on his quest to stop Dr. <laughs> you <Rebecca>. said AIDS. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Sponsored by Sonic the Hedgehog. Go buy his. I don't care. Don't <laughs> Go buy his merch. <laughs> Ew, AIDS are gross. <laughs> you guys know who Junkie X is? Kidding, man. Hey, I'm, I'm really sorry for everybody. Remember, oh, kids, God. if someone gives you AIDS, that's no good. <laughs> that's no good. Hold on a second. Do you guys know who Junkie XL is? Junkie XL. I think I you may have told me, but I'm not sure. I've never told you. I, I'm just finding out this guy right now. Uh, he also goes by Tom Hulkenberg, King the Movies uh, musical score. Huh. Composed for such amazing projects as Inception, Madagascar 3. Oh, God. Was of Radic, was lit. <laughs> and the Resident Sorry. Evil movies. Wait, so he helped with only the third Madagascar movie? Man, wait, uh, I like how we come back to the Resident Evil. <laughs> right? Yeah. Oh, 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 here's the other dumb shit he did the score for. The Amazing Spider-Man 2, which was... Oh, uh, my fave. Uh, he, he composed... All right. He composed <laughs> for Mad Max Fury Road. Okay, that's you know, not bad. Movie. He did Deadpool. Okay. So he's a good composer. He's just... You know, uh, the moment he takes just said whatever that, fucking job they give him. The moment that you said that, he also co-composed for Batman v Superman, Dawn of Justice, and also wrote and composed music for Wonder Woman and Justice League. Oh, oh okay. I actually, like I feel like uh, I feel like I know this guy. I was turned off at Madagascar three. That is understandable, but for video that's, games, uh, that's usually how my dates end. You know, I'm like, "Hey, do you want to watch Madagascar 3? And they're usually like, <sighs> I'd, "I'd rather prefer the second one." Um, I actually don't like movies. <laughs> Madagascar, why? Yeah, nothing will get me pooned more like Madagascar. Shit, you don't know. <laughs> you like that Afro Have circus, you ever tried baby? It? 
Listen, I whenever I you like no. subpar animated comedies, baby. Yeah, I, I, see it. <laughs> I got the perfect one. Cosplay. You like Chris hey, Rock? Cosplay. Don't Do worry, like... no one likes Chris Rock. I do actually. I actually, I actually do kind of like his voice. It's it sounds yeah. unique. You know, I I, I, I don't hear many people with that voice. Um, taken aback because his uh, name for uh, his stage name Junkie XL just sounds fucking stupid and That's it's like I really <laughs> thought he made shit but no he did pretty good for himself in music scores except for the Justice League movies <laughs> well you, you can't you can't help if you get a shit job you think you have a crap job <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! Well, I think with that being said, we've we've had a pretty long episode here, like always. It's already been over an hour. Well, that just goes to show that we don't need a topic to talk about nothing. Right? That's yeah. true. Shoot the shit. Yeah. Get some dick. Shoot. Some... I... So I could get some dick. I I mean, get, get my dick. So I mean, get get get, get, get suck on dick. I mean, God, you always mess that part up. <laughs> damn it! Which one's gay? <laughs> That's the one I want to do, right? <laughs> 2019. There's no sexual orientation anymore. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Uh, before you uh, make a very controversial comment, we better end this like right now. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Uh, yes, <laughs> it, I, like I mean, like we have gone. Do, do like, you hear I'm, that? That's the sound of our careers. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure I said the N word on this in another podcast. So. <laughs> I didn't do like, that. I didn't go ahead. No. <laughs> no. Just no. God damn it. No uh, is an N word. He said the N word. No? Yes, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, is, this the, is this the part where. Is this the. Yes. Our, yes. Our shit? Sadly, we're, we're going to end the podcast here. Everyone, thank you all so much for watching another episode of the Randomizers podcast. Jim, thank you for being on. Don't forget well, thanks to. Thanks for having me anytime. Yeah, and don't everyone don't forget to check out Jim's channels. I'll put them in it's the description a, below. Jim Nobody N O B O D I E. Yes, and also don't forget to watch him play with himself too. Yeah. Here we go. I want everybody to know something. What up? Whenever this comes out, or whatever the fuck. Next week, <laughs> whenever this comes out, <laughs> comes out next week. Next week is when I will upload a video. Okay. So, so right. I, I don't know. All right. Looking well. <laughs> <laughs> forward to it. Alrighty. All right. Well, bye.